Hello and welcome to the University of Colorado Boulder Psychology and Neuroscience Department Spring 2021 Commencement Celebration. I'm Dr. Heidi Day, and it is my honor and privilege to deliver this commencement address today in the traditional format of this academic year. When considering just what to say, I did what many of us might do and turned to Google. And I found this useful article entitled 10 Suggestions for a Successful Commencement Address. How useful. I had a moment to panic though, when I realized I'm expected to give an inspirational address. But they suggested to balance the, the serious with the humorous and somewhat surprisingly, also told me to avoid mentioning my favorite brands of chiropractic supplies. Ah, oh, that makes sense now. So I will do my best. While graduation from CU Boulder represents a milestone in a long journey, it's impossible to ignore the impact that this last year has had. I won't lie, it's been tough. But as Sir Winston Churchill said, while a pessimist sees the difficulty in every opportunity, an optimist sees the opportunity in every difficulty. We know that our resilience is strengthened when we can reframe our challenging experiences. And what a year of challenging experiences we've had. While the loss of too many people to gun violence in our community still feels raw, we can take comfort in the coming together of our community to heal and effect change. Systemic racial discrimination and violence directed towards people of color has been at the fore time and time again. Yet, there are many reasons to hope that social change and justice will prevail with both communities and individuals making a huge difference. And of course, all of our lives were changed dramatically by the pandemic. But luckily, scientists can be heroes too. And with over a billion COVID vaccinations given globally so far, we have reason to be optimistic. If this year taught us anything other than how to bake sourdough bread and do trick shots for the camera, it was the power of our social connections. So share your love and gratitude with your friends and family who provided a shoulder to cry on and those much needed laughs to get you through it all. And I haven't even mentioned all those tough early morning classes, the papers, the presentations, the beloved group projects, the cumulative finals, and the endless Zoom lectures that weren't always as entertaining as this. So, at the end of this tumultuous year, it's time to forge a new path ahead. Some of you know exactly where you're going and some of you may not, and that's okay. Try a few things on for size until you find a path you enjoy. But for now, take a moment to reflect on all you have accomplished despite the obstacles in your path. To the class of 2021, it only remains for me to offer my wholehearted congratulations to you all. You are the future and you will do us proud.